It is another great morning to be back. Despite the situation you find yourself, always persevering would be the ultimate objective of ensuring that you achieve your goals. But in order for you to persevere also means that there needs to be some level of consistency. And perseverance linked with consistency also means that there's the constant urge to reinvigorate yourself, motivate yourself, and keep doing what you're doing, despite the failures. We all tend to encounter difficulties in our daily choices that we make, because sometimes the decisions we make would always not end well, and we will fail. Despite those failures, know that it doesn't matter how old you are, how young you are, but once you have life, you always need to keep at it. Because failure is just a step to becoming successful. But within all these, you also need the time and the patience. And I hope all of us are going to keep to these virtues. Because I also do the same. I failed many times in my life. But I also do know, once I have life, there's always hope that is always around the corner as I'm prepared to meet that grace that I know God has favored me for. The next three hours are for you. Please get interactive. Join News on TV is on Facebook. At Join News on TV is our Twitter handle. And you can watch us live through my Join Online TV on YouTube. We always encourage you, as you watch the content we provide, to always send us more of your messages. And over the last week or two, we've been on this great initiative. And we've always been concluding or encouraging you to add hashtag Alive Alive to all the messages that you tend to send to us. Because the road and how you use it, how you use it, is always going to be yours. The decisions you make on the road, the decisions somebody is making on the road would always have some effect on you. Arrive Alive is supposed to ensure we are all safe on the road. Today, we will continue updating you on what is happening in regard to the coronavirus. Well, uh, there's supposed to be a case recorded in Cote d'Ivoire. Now, Kenya has also recorded it. It speaks volumes about how, even though we have a lot of passengers or travelers on the Africa-China route, we just don't have our health systems well enough. But in Ghana, we say we are doing a lot. And so, uh, on the side of business, because it's a Wednesday, on AMBs, well, we're going to look at the coronavirus and how the neighboring countries we have, especially Côte d'Ivoire and the authorities in Ghana on higher alert to check passengers at the country's main entry ports. And we're talking the Kotoka International Airport. But ultimately, businesses will be counting the losses. Are they going to be affected vastly by this. We already do know that, well, there's been a 22 billion profit posted by Apple, but they've also given the indication that it could affect the next quarter results mm, because, again, corona. But we've also had some great reports that is indicating that all is not well in relation to our young people, especially in North Ghana. Now, on the discussion table, we're going to have an emerging trend about substance abuse among young people and its effect. And Rafiq Salam, our Power's regional correspondent, brought to us a story about how young people, not only in the northern part of the country, but are apparently uh, trickling down to the south, are now smoking dried feces, a bean, and soaking sanitary parts in water, boiling it, and drinking it for what they call vitality. Well, that's a shocking revelation also being indicated by the Narcotics Control Board about how this new trend of drug abuse or narcotic abuse is having an effect on young people. So we'll touch base with the Upper West Regional Commander of the Board, Ishak Bakuri, and also get some insight from the Minister of the Interior and more so right here in the studio. We'll speak to some of those professionals in psychotropic uh, medicine or mental health, as we want to call it. So make sure you stay with us. If you're in a community in which you have any of those drugs being abused or the narcotics being abused, let us know. You can always ta uh, tag us with many pictures, 
and also many of your comments as well. We'll conclude with some great entertainment stories. But we'll bring you the latest news headlines, tell you what is up for sports, and of course, bring you some great motivation, which is right up with Kojo Yangtze. Do stay with us. We'll be right back. <laughs>